Hi folks, Tim here again from High End Cheap Tech and today we're going to go over a phone I highly recommend purchasing. It's a little over the normal dollar amount that I would select, but budget goes from 0 to 300, 300 to 600, it's mid-range 600 to 900, it's high end and should be flagship and 900 and above is stupid. Sorry if you get offended by that and you wondered if you're a budget user, you're not probably coming to this site, you know, if you're not one. Uh, so we're going to get right to it after the intro and I'll talk all about it and show you some pictures and tell you why I would buy this phone if I had the money right now. Let's get to it, shall we? All right, folks, the phone we're talking about today is the Huawei P30 Lite. Coming up on the screen now. I'll leave it up there a few seconds so you can take in its beauty and wonderfulness. This is an excellent phone, folks. It's got great specs. Uh, let me go ahead and read them off to you. Got to use the notes because I couldn't see the screen with the specs. It's got a 24 megapixel wide rear shooter. I don't know if that's pixel bend or if it's going to shoot right at 24 megapixel. Uh, an 8 megapixel ultra wide. Pretty normal. Got a 2 megapixel depth sensor. It's got a 32 megapixel front shooter at 1080 30. All these are 1080 30. Live with it. It's all you need. Especially if you're a budget user. Are you shooting movies? Are you shooting. You know, tech videos, I'm shooting tech videos, and I only shoot at 1080p 30 like we are right now. And I'll probably put it out at 720. And uh, last but not least, it has a 1080 by 2312 Full HD Plus display with 415 pixels per inch, nice and bright. Come on, folks, this is a good phone. So let's move on to the accessories you should buy. Uh, they only got 19 of these left, so I suggest you use the links in the description below. I can't say that enough. Read the description below. Next, coming up on the screen, if you buy the blue one, there is a black one up floating around up there, but the price goes up. They got a white one too. Get the blue and get this Rinky Fusion X case for it. Link will be in the description below on Amazon. You can get it in a few days and uh, shipping will be free. <sighs> and by the way, if you order the Huawei phone, you probably have to go through Prime. Sign up for the free trial order. You'll have it in no time slot. You start playing with it, just don't drop it. Um, the Rinky uh, Fusion X is a gorgeous case. In fact, when I gave away the uh, Redmi Note 8 because it just didn't work, the one thing I was so sad about was that damn Rinky case because it made that phone look so good. It's this little blue ring around it. You know, when screen was lit up. It's like, oh, that's so cool. How does, how does Huawei do that? It's not. It's the case. It's just covering up those bezels. And it looks super cool. It's a fantastic case. Very good protection. Clear back so you can still see the pretty back and show it to your friends if you're 12 years old and want to impress them. And last but not least on the list, I don't, I didn't bother taking a picture. Yes, this phone, you can get a Skinomi Thin Film Matte Screen Protector like I have on the phone we're shooting on. It's super thin. It doesn't show fingerprints at all. 
And, you know, if the angle's off just, uh, you know, quite a bit, people can't look over your shoulder and see what the hell you're doing. And it's anti-glare. It works super good. Because you don't have a mesh fingerprint reader or, you know, in-screen. You won't care because the fingerprint reader on this phone is on the back. So you lay it down, and that rinky case will actually lift it up, you know, good, well, far enough that you can hold off on the Skonomi, but I wouldn't hold off too long. For $7.85, buy it. Follow all the instructions. I have put three of these on, two on the Axon M and one on here. If you follow the instructions, make sure you place it. There's no dust or cigarette smoke dropping ashes from the sky. You don't get any bubbles. Just do what it says. Follow the instructions. Be very careful to follow them all. And then do what it says in the video. They have a video that will tell you exactly how to do it. And uh, all that being said, that's all I got. Uh, it, it, this phone does have a USB-C and 18-watt charging, so it's going to charge up quick. Of course, you could add wireless charging to it, like I use on this phone. Just check my website for how to add wireless. And so on that note, <laughs> I think we're done. Hopefully you found this useful, informative, like, share, and subscribe. Leave feedback in the comments below. And uh, read that description. There's a place in there you can donate a few bucks. Hell, all the subscribers I have now, if everyone donated one dollar, I'd have two of these and I'd give one away. Trust me. I would. I love to give away stuff. And especially stuff that works good. So, uh, we'll catch you in the next one. Have a super fantastic day. And thanks for watching.